I will be listening to great music, but I can't really play it for you because Instagram will go bonkers. Let's start with Dame Joan Collins. Where would she be if she was on a wall? I know where. Today's episode. How are you doing, Dr. Babas? And welcome to Stories of My Life. So today I've been just cleaning, cleaning and tidying up, sort of just scouring the surface because beneath it's just too much. Uh, had a great lunch, been recycling. Now I think I'll do a spot of interior decorating. Remember all those cutouts? For magazines that I did on what Saturday? Yeah, it's time to find that sort of elephant snot they call it in Denmark. I don't know what we call it in English, but yeah, look at that. And soon there will be something else on the walls. What else? So today's going to be a sort of. I'm going to take it easy. Got tomorrow, I'm going to see two shows. And on Wednesday, I, Martin, and our friend Emil, <coughs> he's a very good friend, uh, are going to Uppsala to see next to, to the musical Next to Normal with our friend Martin, another Martin. Um, that will be quite enjoyable, I hope. I saw it, I see it twice, once in New York. And one in and, uh, in Stadstjorten here in Sweden, Stockholm. God. Uh, but now, on to the interior your decorations. I will be listening to great music, but I can't really play it for you because Instagram will go bonkers. Let's start with Dame Joan Collins. Where would she be if she was on a wall? I know where. So this might look a little silly, just, you know, putting her in between two LP sleeves. But imagine this whole wall will be filled with loveliness. So then she sort of just be one in a hundred thousand. I don't know. This is a quite unknown LP where Barbara Streisand sang two songs, I think. Okay, people, so far, and I have lots of cutouts still waiting to go up. But just now I'm uploading stuff to my, uh, no, in Swedish, to my YouTube channel and to my Swedish Instagram account as well. It's all about theatre. Okay, people, I'm on my way home to my friend Ulf's. We are going to have pizza. He found a place where I have that have vegan pizza and regular pizza because he's, he's, he's a conic, he's carnivorous. Anyway, I'm gonna go there, but first I need to go to buy some groceries because tomorrow I'm gonna, this is gonna be a hectic few days off work because I'm gonna see three plays. No, one musical, one reading and one play. No, so three different things, but hectic all the same. So tomorrow I need to bring sandwiches because I don't start eating until 12 o'clock. And that's when the play starts. So I need to have sandwiches so I can eat that in the intermission. Yeah, I really plan my life. So join me as I buy food and watch telly and eat pizza. So I'm gonna go in here and buy something that I can turn into some sort of sandwich or something. A wrap, maybe. Oh, by the way, now is <laughs> It's a bad time to be on a bike because one thing, people are going, going out from work and they are all sort of, lots of them are not like this asshole who's run a stoplight. They don't know the rules. Okay, people, I have no idea. Look what they have. Sriracha mayo, vegan sriracha mayo at my uh, local grocery store. Fantastic. People, it's six o'clock. And there's still daylight. Well, dusk. But 
Summer is coming, people. Just when you thought it'll never happen, it is on its way. I can feel it in my bones. <laughs> so, no, it's so funny. Just saw one get in, and I hope that person takes the elevator so I don't have to, ch to share it. I don't know why. I think it's a corona thing. I can almost taste it. Well, I can... Oregano. That's it. Just let in. Pizza. Oh, good. Someone took the elevator. Someone took the elevator. And... I can... Oh, someone's coming down. I hope not. I hope that's for me. Well, anyway, if they're coming down, they're going out. Because this is the bottom floor. Yes, right, no. Nervous? Me? No. <laughs> Why? Empty. Mind the gap. Mind the gap. Buongiorno. Ah, pizza. Oh, God, can't get out of my shoes. Oh, my God. This is, oops, pizza. this is the best pizza place in the city, you say? No, the best pizza orientale. Pizza, oh, best pizza orientale. What's orientale? It would like minced meat and stuff. Oh, stuff. This is a vegan one. Oh, this looks really good. And the pizza's name is Pizzerias Rimini. Rimini. Good. People, call my agent, season three. Pizza. This is for Sauvignon Rick. This is what a Swedish pizza salad looks like. Just, yeah, cabbage. Sort of three episodes. We got one season left of Call My Agent. Then Ulf tells me he, he's got a present for me, but he's not quite sure where in this mess he's left it. And I'm not putting any pressure on him to find it. Okay. He's <laughs> now going to describe the present because he can't find it. Use your words. Worse when I can use knives. <laughs> so what was it? It's a thing that you screw on your... <laughs> what? This is like... Kitchen aid bowl. Oh! But I can't find it. Oh! Apparently it was a bowl for one of the uh, things I've got from him before, uh, an electric appliance. But I forgive, I, I think I forgive you if you can't find it. He's, I forgive him for losing my bowl. Am I losing my bowl? But you still have my shoes to walk home in. I do? Yes. What? The shoes you got from me. The shoes I'm wearing now? Yeah. Oh yes they are. From America. Americano. Barney's. Now, now I need to show them to you. Here are the shoes Ulf gave me years and years ago. They're from Barney's. The edition of the black shoelaces are mine. It's mine. The edition of is mine, yes. Now we're looking at hoarders. Hoarders in real life and hoarders on telly. Go home. <laughs> <laughs> yes, people. He lives in complete misery. He still finds time to look beautiful and sort of decorate himself. This is fantastic. So it's time to say goodbye. goodbye. Have you had a fantastic time? Yes. Lovely. Yeah. Charming. Exquisite. Any other words? Uh, no. No other words? You, you don't, you, 
You're a lack of words. You don't know what I'm to say. Speechless. Can you sing something, maybe? Never. But we're just waiting for the fucking elevator. Sing something when I. No. No. Thank you for watching and for liking, commenting, subscribing and following. It really helps and uh, something to do with the internet and the algorithm, I think. So thank you so much.